welcome back to Keterific Journey. I'm Mike, your reformed fat man. Oops. Well, I got some green tomatoes here that I've cut up, and I hope you can see them. And I'm gonna pick this one up off the floor and put it in the trash. But I've got some cheese, pork panko, by the way, this is, uh, I bought it one time and I've been grinding it up ever since, using this to sort in. Because it's got a label on it. And I'm gonna use those ingredients, add some salt and pepper, and I'm gonna make green tomato chaffles. So stick around and let's see if Mike can screw this up. Okay, so I've put some pork panko on the surface of the waffle iron, the mini waffle iron, or chaffle iron if you prefer. Now I'm going to put a little cheese. It's still warming up a little bit. It's not completely up to temperature yet, but that's okay. It gives me a chance to get them constructed because it takes a second, and I don't want them to burn. All right, so you take that and you do that, and then you put your cheese, your tomatoes around. Yep. Put them around here. You can hear it starting to sizzle a little bit. Let's get over to the other one now. Okay. One more piece up here. That ought to do it. And now we put some more cheese on it. On the top of it. I think we got it covered pretty good. I'm gonna go with it. Now we put a little more pork panko on top. That'll give it that crunchy, crispy, green, fried green tomato feel by putting it on top. I gotta grind me up some more of this. Close her up and let her do her thing. And then we'll be back in a minute. All right, there's our fried green tomato, our chicken nuggets we made in the previous video, and I put some coleslaw to go with it. So you can see it turned out pretty well. It'll, it'll crisp up as it gets cooler. Right now, it's not real crispy because of that, but it'll, it will crisp up as it cools down. Although it's it's pretty crisp right now. But it'll tighten up, won't be as loose. So let's see if we can get uh, the wonderful Miss Page and the wonderful and lovely Miss Page to do a taste test for us. Okay there. 
Appreciate you, Galford, uh, agreeing to do a taste test for us. You have uh, a fried green tomato made on the waffle iron, and you got some chicken nuggets there also. So. And coleslaw. And coleslaw. But it looks different. Uh, it's a finer chop. Much finer chop on it, but other than that, it's the same. Okay, so this is chicken nugget. Mm-hmm. Mm, this is delicious. Mm. And we had chicken nuggets here not too long back, but it, they were uh, made with canned chicken. This was made with uh, uncooked chicken that was um, ground up. Mm, it's very good. And then this is a fried green tomato. Green but it's made on the waffle iron. Mm. 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 Really good. <sighs> I love it. Mm. I love it. Yum, yum, yum. Alrighty. I thank you kindly. I thank you kindly. This is so good. Alrighty. Thank you, sir. Mike at Key to Journey. Yes, be careful out there.